You take care of business. Give her a swing swipe. Ooh, don't knock her. Ooh. Oh, good job, Gordon. <laughs> All right, let's heal up again. Man, look at this. Oblivion ain't shit. Who gives a damn? Look out, Lord Dagon. I'm coming for you. Man, she messed up my gloves, though. All right, let's see. Can we somehow jump around there? Let's see. Let's do a quick save here. A quick, quick save. All right, can we do some sort of fantastic maneuver? Oh, shit, there's a bit of invisible. Oh, oh God. Oh, God. <laughs>— What's good? Welcome back to Oblivion. We're hanging out here, out front of this uh, horrific Oblivion gate, and a bunch of naked men, and a bunch of splayed demons, and our old friend back there who's holding the door. Oh, fuck. <laughs> well, this is great. And there's also a terrifying titty woman who is out here ready to fucking— Oh, great. And look, also, in between videos, I went and did, um— I filled up all my soul gems and stuff. Hence why I went to go and summon Gordon, but instead a skeleton man came out. Good lord. This, this is, oh god. Oh god, and another Gordon? As it turns out, this Oblivion Gate is extremely active. Can we just, <laughs> fuck this, I don't want to fuck with these dudes. Let's just roll up on in here. Oh my god, there's a lot of people coming out. Holy shit, hold the line, man. Don't worry, I'm going in. Oblivion Gate to Plane of Oblivion. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good lord. Uh, and here we go. Welcome to- welcome to hell, I guess. Oh, god. Look, already, you can tell it's very much a fresh hell. There's a man running for his fucking life. There's another titty spider coming after us. Oh, what's not to love? <laughs> Jesus Christ. This is- oh, god. Oh, Gordon, where are you- oh, she's resistant to it. Oh, this ain't good. Oh, god. Oh, jeez. All right. <laughs> Fuck me. This is real bad. This is bad. All right, here. Let's, <laughs> let's throw some of this shit on, huh? There we go. That's enough. Maybe we'll be able to kill her. Oh, or maybe she'll just shock the shit out of us. Turn me perp. There we go. Uh, take it, you foul knave. You foul knave. <laughs> Look at I love how they go flying. Man, we are almost dead. We are really almost dead. Oh, I hope that was our go No, it wasn't. Oh, it was not. Woo! <laughs> oh, eat a butt. Oh, eat a damn butt. Here we go. Put a petty soul in there. Get a few more strikes going. Uh. Oh! Stunning you! Oh! Oh, God. This is getting intense. Oh, my God. Welcome to Oblivion, huh? Welcome to Oblivion Land. Woo! Flying demons. Oh, what's not to love? All right. Is our friend... <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Remember when I said a long time ago that there's no chance in, in hell that... Oh, great. That anybody would survive. <laughs> there you fucking have it. <laughs> dude, dude did not last a fucking minute, did he? Oh, man. Poor guy. <laughs> For fuck's sake. All right. Spider Daedra. Yeah, we already lured them all. Okay, good stuff. Man, yeah, we are definitely gonna need to grab all those goodies. Oh, right. Oh, God, we need to be careful. I almost forgot. Some of these plants, they try to harvest you. Oh, God. Let's see, does this guy actually have anything worthwhile on him? Worth taking? Healing potions. Maybe we should, um... I don't know. Let's at least take his trash here and, like, repair it up. We'll leave him naked on the floor. Boom. There we go. Get some, uh, armor or XP. Why the heck not? Alright. Let's see. Should we face down this evil Gordon? Probably. Let's go and go on over here and check out this thing. Can we actually open this? I can't remember. Oh, fuck. Yo, there's a lot of dudes in there. It's opened elsewhere. Oh, man. We have to go to a whole other continent? Shit. We were... <laughs> fuck me. That is bad. <laughs> That is bad. Oh, man. <laughs> it's the, uh, the Oblivion effect. Oh, God. We're about to get, like, uh, Jack Nicholson right there. Jesus Christ, by that plant. All right. Man, there's a lot of Gor evil Gordons over there. Oh, no, wait. One of those is just a big-ass rock. All right, fine. Oh, shit. We really need to rebind Gordon. Speaking of Gordon. There we go. 
Let's quick save as well. Look, there's another titty lady over there, spinning her web of lies. My god. All right. Gordon, to battle! Here we go. Knock him into the damn fire, too, while you're at it, Gordon. See if you can't fuck him up in a major damn way. Yes! Knock him into the damn lava! Oh, this is our tactic! Oh, what a tactic it is! Oh my god, look, it looks like a delicious kind of jelly jam! Oh, god! <laughs> Fuck! Oh man, I'm on edge. <laughs> this is not good. This is not a good oh. way to- Oh god! Oh, at least I'm highly resistant to fire. Oh, alright, let's heal up for an hour. <laughs> good god. This- this can only go poorly, can't it? I mean, hey, this- If anything, it can only go up from here. I mean, we've- this is pretty much the- the worst thing that could, uh, possibly befall us. Ugh, jeez. So far, it's worked out to where both of our, um... Both the Morrowind playthrough and the Oblivion playthrough have worked out to where... In both of them, you know what, even in Fallout, we're in very inhospitable, shitty areas with horrific hellscape sorts of skyboxes. <laughs> Good god. Alright. Yeah, let's come on over here, see if we can't fight this titty lady. Maybe we can lure her into the, the fire. Come on, lady! Come on! Let's- let's have a- a jam! Let's have a go! Let's have a dance! Look at her little friend, her mini-me. Look, what's she doing? Is she doing some kind of, like, seductive dance? Is she, is she trying to seduce me? Does her little friend... do a lot? It doesn't seem like it. Seems like I can stagger the shit up. Oh! Oh! Jeez! Oh god, it's doing some sort of foul magic! Oh! Holy fuck, I jumped over it! Oh man! Oh, there we go. Yeah, stand in that shit, you dumb butt! You dumb butt! Look, I'm gonna paralyze you up- Oh! <laughs> oh man, lava is good, dude. Oh my god, Red Mountain beckons, you bastard. You foul, foul bastard. Jesus. Alright, healing up again. Do they respawn in here? <laughs> Do they, are there respawns? I don't know. I hope not. I sure as shit hope not. Ugh. Ooh. Fleshy pod. Oh, okay. I thought we were trying to get some blood grass. There we go. Got some blood grass. Ugh. Look at this thing. Looks like a mud crab claw with a disgusting fart coming out of it. Alright. Oh, yeah. We need to remember to repair up again. Our uh, durability is quick to degrade. Quite frankly. All right. Let's see. Oh, yep. There is a foul, evil Gordon over there. Okay. Do we have something that we can use to pull him? We can pull him with a riot spell, huh? Let's try it. Ba Boom! Come on, evil Gordon. Oh. Did he not notice? Come on. Wow, he doesn't give a damn. All right. Sure. Let's shoot him with a flare. Why not? Or no, let's finger him. There we go. Haha! -ha! Eat a butt. Let's get ready to paralyze him inside the hell lava. Oh look, he doesn't want to come over. I think he knows. Oh, should we go over there and greet him instead? Oh, I don't know about that. Is it going to be safe cro safe passage for us? Does he not want really not want to come over here? Oh man, the the AI is actually kind of smart. All right, here, let's quick save. Stow our weapon and try and do a fantastic. Uh, jump, the likes of which would make our ancestor proud. Oh, God, I didn't jump at all. Oh, I just ran through lava. Okay, there we go. I hope you're proud, ancestor. I hope you're proud. Jeez. Oh, oh, there we go. All right, let's quick save. Let's see. I feel like there's no reason for us to be over here, honestly. Oh, there we go. Stun locking him, knocking him over into the flames of Balthazar. There we go. Ooh, look, we're actually doing some good damage to him. Oh, man, even without the enchant. We aren't half bad. We're pretty decent-ass swordsmen, huh? Damn, my pirate and ways are, uh... Something to be, uh... Sort of... Gasped and gaped upon. I'm not sure what that means, but... It's... It's, it's an impressive sort of feat. Is that a man? What is that? Oh, is that another titty lady up there? Oh, it is. Oh, man. The Plain of Oblivion. More like the Plain of Gordon and Tit Mongrels. Jesus. Big old Gordon McGordons. Jesus Christ. 
Good thing, at least, at least we don't have to deal with Gordon's, like, humongous, scaly, ribbed wangus. I mean, at least, at least there's not that. Or, perhaps, unfortunately there's not that. You know what? Unfortunately not. <laughs> the evil Gordon Wang. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh man, he just has, like, on a, some sort of bizarre jock strap or something. <laughs> What the fuck are we even talking about? Man, this is really something. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, shit, look at this! Oh, we just Elder scrolls our way up here. You know what? Hey, I'm gonna take... Oh, is this a good idea? Or is this a really bad idea? Uh-oh. You know what? We're gonna Gandalf this bastard. We're gonna Gandalf the shit out of him. Let's see. Come on! I'm ready to Gandalf you right into this pit. You shall not pass, you sick bastard! Look, this bastard, however, is totally gonna be immune to my wiles. Oh! Oh, there you go! I'll knock you up in there! Deftly avoiding her flame attack! There we go! Keep smacking that sweet ass up in there! Ugh. Oh, shit! Whoop! There you go! <laughs> Hasta la vista! <laughs> Oh, man. This game is pretty good, huh? <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Did he die? Oh, yep. He's dead. Now, she's not gonna take any fucking damage at all, so we're just gonna get out our own damn Gordon here. Uh-oh. She- <laughs> Look at her go! Look at her get tripped! Whoop! There you go. You like that? You like that, you asshole? Gordon, finish her off. She's- she's still kind of painful. I'm gonna quick save, Gordon. You take care of business. Give her a swing swipe. Ooh, don't knock her- Ooh! Oh, good job, Gordon. <laughs> Alright, let's heal up again. Man, look at this! Oblivion ain't shit! Who gives a damn? Look out, Lord Dagon, I'm coming for you. Man, she messed up my gloves, though. Alright, let's see. Can we somehow jump around there? Let's see, let's do a quick save here. A quick, quick save. Alright, can we do some sort of fantastic maneuver? Oh, shit, there's a bit of invisible- Oh! Oh God! Oh God! Can I get out? Can I get out? Oh, or do I have to load? Oh, I'm gonna have to load. <laughs> Fuck! All right, it's fine. It's fine. We we quick save. We planned ahead. We planned ahead. Everything's fine. Oh God! Oh no! I forgot about these things. They're like demonic ground traps. You know what? We should go the proper way, especially since this is our first Oblivion Gate. Once we get through with uh, more of them, we'll we'll go around these wild ass directions. Oh, God. Man. There sure are a lot of, uh, invisible walls, honestly. Probably so you can't super jump around a lot of places. Right? Probably so you can't do that. Alright. Let's see. Oh! Oh, man. Jeez. What is this, like, Dark Souls? Am I about to get the fucking, uh... Flame Ember to let old shirtless man do some work? Damn. God, the the fucking ultimate uh, co games commentary, modern games commentary. Oh, it's like Dark Souls. It's it's the Dark Souls of Elder Scrolls. Jesus Christ, my God. <laughs> oh, here we go. These are the ones that slap you. The Harada root. Ooh. All right. Look at all this, man. I just want to jump down there. Honestly, I can't resist it. Look at that. <clears throat> Fuck me up, lethal lava land. Damn. All right, there we go. Good lord. Oh shit. I hear some sort of foul bastard on the other side of this uh, fantastic sh sort of shale rock barrier. Alright. Oh, it's a titty. It's a titty lady. <laughs> oh god. Oh, I'm burning a little bit. Ooh. Oh shit. Ooh. It's her mini me. Ooh, take it. Oh god. She's electro primed. Alright. Can we do a sort of fantastic leap up here? All right, we need to kite her around to this side. That way we can uh, engulf her into the lavic uh, sort of do doom and death. All right, come hither! Come hither, you foul bastard! Ooh, ooh, her little mini me has faded away into the abyss. All right, let's see. Is she gonna come over here, or is she just uh? <laughs> the fuck's going on here? All right, you know what? Oh shit. Yeah, they're resistant, aren't they? I wonder if they're fully immune to it. Oh, jeez. Look, she's got her own sort of paralysis as well. Gordon, finish him off! Come on, Gordon. I know you can do it. Oh, God! Anything? Anything? Oh, no, she just reflected it onto me. Oh, spiders are crawling up my a-hole. Oh, Gordon! Oh, Gordon! 
Save me! Ooh, slap her, give her a slap! Yes! There we go. Ooh, that's the good shit. Uh-oh. That's the bad shit. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, Gordon. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, jeez. All right, there we go. Gordon, have you finished her off yet? There. Oh, good job, Gordon. Holy crap, we make one hell of a team, don't we, pal? Oh, all right. Repair that shit up. What have you got for me? Oh, uh, there we go. Oh, man, look at... Wow. <laughs> what the fuck is going on here? <laughs> Jesus. You know, this, there's really something to be said for ragdolls. Uh, it's, uh... It's really something. It'll be sad <laughs> when uh, these games stop having that ridiculous bullshit. All right. Let's do a quick save again. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Man, a, a, our first trip to Oblivion has been, honestly, kind of a real fucking treat, but also a real, like, uh, period of suffering. Just a real period of suffering and hell and just god-awful times. But uh, at the same time, fantastic times. Honestly, and that's probably what you expect. Some good times, some bad times. Watching another man die, making him naked, fighting titty beasts, fighting evil Gordons. What's not to love? Picking grass. Some sort of, like, needle grass, I think. Good lord. I wonder why it's called blood grass. Because it's red? Or do you think it's actually from, like, the blood of beasts? Or some shit like that. Look, can we jump up here? Is this, like, a little secret thing? I don't think so. No. This is just a strange, bizarre area. Within the... The gelatinous fields of goo. Good lord. Alright, now this one's gonna try and thwack us. Ooh! Ooh! Ooh, did I get it? Ooh! Ooh, I don't like it. Ooh, get away. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Healing. Oh, shit. Oh, they're throwing rocks at me. Oh, fuck you, Lord Dagon! Fuck you! <laughs> Jesus. Alright. Let's get on over here. Fight this evil Gordon. Alright, evil Gordon. Oh, look. Is Evil Gordon about to get hit by a big boulder? Come over here, Evil Gordon! Oh, man. That would have been great. Ooh. Oh, shit. Can I pick this up? Holy shit! I have the strength of a thousand men! Oh, my God. Look at me. I'm pub buff as hell! Look, I'm moving a fucking giant boulder! Oh, my God. Chris Redfield would be proud. <gasps> oh, God! Oh, it almost killed me! Oh! <laughs> Fuck. Oh, uh, let's back up and heal up. Oh, there we go. We're safe. It's all good. It's all good. All right, we can use this against Evil Gordon, though, I think. Let's try it. Oh, whoops. Here we go. Let's see. Ah, oh, Evil Gordon, come hither, you foul bastard. Look, I'm gonna throw a fucking huge-ass rock at you. Oh, shit, listen to that. It's hurting him. Is it hurting him? Uh, uh. Ugh, take it, Ow. Evil Gordon! I'm throwing rocks at you! Ugh. 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 I'll throw this rock all over your dumb ass! Ugh. Oh shit, I'm throwing it at myself too! Ugh. Take it! Oh, oh god! Oh, oh, Gordon! Oh, oh. oh fuck! Oh. There you go! Enjoy! <laughs> Alright, oh jeez. Oh, jeez. He's still got power. He's still got power. He's still got strength. Oh, look at him go. Oh, he's fucked now for sure. <laughs> yes. Oh, no, no. Oh. Eat butt. Eat butt. Oh, eat it. Eat it. Eat it. Please go into the lava. Oh, jeez. He's throwing rocks, too. He's got much more power. Oh, he's, he's my Wesker for sure. Oh, go in there. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, what's going on? This is getting fucked up. All right. <laughs> We've done it. Oh, God, I'm stuck. Uh, oh, oh, oblivion is hell. Oh, oh, there we go. <laughs> My God. Oh, what a fucking party this has been. Oh, jeez. Also, I love uh, how this boulder has kind of an anus. Look at that. It has like a puckered little anus right there. Jesus. <laughs> Let's fix all this stuff up. Oh, jeez. Oh, man. What, what a great place, Oblivion. Oh, it's gotta be said. Alright. Nothing really down here. No secret woot loots. 
I don't think there's really anything uh, worth looting and looting in these places that isn't, like, randomly generated loot. Oh, shit, is that, like, a Storm Atronach up there? Makes sense. Surprised we only saw Fire Atronachs. I guess it'd be... It'd be pretty damn bizarre if we saw Frost Atronachs up in here. I wonder if they can even spawn here. Oh, there's a titty gal. All right. Let's see. Can we shove this bastard up into the dam? Mm. Yeah, I think we freaking can. Oh, yeah. All right. Oh, there we go. Man, that spell is so good. All right, Gordon to me. Let's have at them. Oh, Gordon is doing his celebratory dance. Oh, shit, dude is smack- Oh, no! Oh, he fucked me up big time. All right, that's fine, that's fine. Let's see, do you think this- Oh, jeez, I keep uh, pressing the wrong uh, ability here. I keep forgetting that that is no longer on one. It is my swad that is on one. There we go. Do you think that affects the titty lady? No, I don't think so. All right. I know there's a few danger who that does affect. But apparently it's not, um... Just like Raptor, nor the titty woman. All right. Let's get Gordon down here. I think we did a successful pull of just one enemy. All right. Damn, this dude is pissed as shit, honestly. Let's knock him on down there. There we go, Gordon. Throw him off the damn side. Yeah! Double team! Mm. All right. Grab its claws. Grab a lockpick. It doesn't weigh anything, but it is worth something. Look at Gordon with his celebratory Godzilla scream. Holy shit. All right. Let's fall back a bit to where we can rest up. Mm, there we go. Conserving those potions. Look at that. Let's see. Let's also repair up. Boom. Fantastic. And let's pull her. Let's see. Should we uh, try and just go on up here and just kind of slam and jam at her? Oh, look, I've got a great idea. Maybe we can just slam and jam her into a damn, uh, one of these numbers. Let's see. Can we just, like, slam jam her? Oh, shit. Gordon got paralyzed. Oh, man, she is fast as hell. Oh, God. Did I just jump over her electroshock again? Gordon, focus fire this one. Good job, Gordon. Good job. Gordon, I'd try and help you out here, but honestly, I can't. Oh, shit, she shot lightning out of her asshole. At Gordon, too. Oh, God, what's she doing? Oh, she's doing some fucked up stuff. Oh, she's shooting me with the big perp. Oh, I'm not liking it. Let's get another Gordon now. Why not? Oh, God, that hurts. Oh, God, what's she doing? Oh, it's hard to tell when she's about to do an electro blast and a super smash. Oh, God, she's fast as hell. Get the hell away from me, Quaylag! Oh! Oh! God! I'm jumping into hell! Oh, look! Oh, good job, Gordon. Good job. You've done it. Oh, look. She's just... She... Th shoved her own head right into her ass. <laughs> good lord. That's one parting gift to us. Oh, God. Ugh. Potion of the sea. Grab some of these. Spittle stick. Ugh. They're like disgusting sunflowers. They're like really disgusting sunflowers that instead of like being beautiful and giving you potentially food and like food for animals and stuff that come by to like nibble on the seeds and nibble on and just sort of take in the beauty. Instead, it just farts right in your damn face. And you go to take a nice... Uh, oh, God! Jesus! <laughs> it just farts in your face. Oh, God. What a hellish place. I like... I want to know who the fuck thought... Hey, yeah, these plants that we have in Oblivion, let's make them also just try and shit on you the whole time. Whoever the hell thought of that one. What a, what a jackanape, honestly. There we go. Look at that, Gordon actually using some of his fiery attacks. Oh, man, these things just sound god-awful, don't they? All right, let's heal up again. Actually got kind of messed up there. Jeez, I'm Pete. All right, was that Gordon who actually did that? Did Gordon's thing have, like, an AoE effect? I'm not sure, but I'm not liking it, honestly. All right. Gordon? Oh, shit, it's one of those things. Look. You see it over there in the damn distance? Oh, shit, it just blew the fuck up. Look at that. Oh, I remember them. Oh, shit, Gordon got kind of flattened. Uh-oh. Jeez, Gordon. Careful. You gotta go after the big mama. Not the little mini-me. There you go, Gordon. There you go. 
Yeah, now you know what's up. Now you know what's up. Oh, jeez. Should we come in here and try and help out Gordon? I think so. Oh, shit. Did she just eat Gordon and get health? Oh, God. How come her thing doesn't actually hurt us? Is it, like, secretly sapping all of our stats or something? Look at her go. She's traveling like crazy. Oh, God. Oh! Oh, jeez. I like how when she casts a spell, her cast on self animation is like, Look at my tits! <laughs> that, that's what the animation is like. Man, check me out. I got big spider tits. Damn. Holy shit. What do you think happens when you milk a spider tit lady? Do you think you get some actual milk? Or is it like um, some sort of, uh, like, spider... Spider slime? <laughs> they're, uh, they're webbing, right? Hmm. Who knows? I'm not sure. Do you think they're, they're classified as some sort of, like, bug? Or as, like, a mammal? I don't know. Let's have a quick save here. Let's see, what kind of ears do they have, by the way? Let's have a look. I'm curious now. Do they even have ears? Ooh, they have, like, a weird headdress hat kind of situation going on. They definitely have, like, the, uh, the white anime-ass hair, don't they? Oh, jeez. Is she, like, really stuck? Oh, god. Oh, my god. Jesus, look at her scream! Her hellish beast scream! Oh, my god. What a horrific, like, horror movie. You would think that this was, like, the result of some sort of, like, stupid-ass, like, I'm horny as hell mod. You know, have you ever seen a anyone doing, like, a playthrough with, like, a horny as hell mod? Where, like, everybody goes up, like... 50, like, bazillion cup sizes, and, like, all the armor is just, like, scantily clad as damn hell. Fuck me. <laughs> but as it turns out, hey, that's just, uh, they just look that way. They just look that way. Alright. Let's see. Let us actually, instead of having this, uh, weapon bound to one, because we're really not gonna swap away from it, are we? Let's, uh, let's just see. We should be able to... Oh, shit, we can't. Uh-oh. Well, that ain't great. All right, Gordon, it's time to fuck some shit up. There we go. Maybe we just missed... Or maybe we have to use a fire spell to disarm it. There's definitely a way you can, like, mash those things. <sighs> there we go. Fantastic. You know what? I wonder... I wonder if these little things... Oh shit, look, it's a big man. All right. I wonder if these things, these little bomb mine things, if the um, mines in Fallout actually use some of the same code for, like, uh, detonating when you get close and all that stuff. Huh. I've never thought of that. Oh, shit. That shit came back. Let's see. Can I blast this thing? Definitely not with shock. How about with fire? Fire in the hole. Did I miss it? Oh, shit! Alright, fire definitely works, but did shock actually work and I just missed it? I need to aim up a little bit. I don't think shock actually does jack shit. I think it's gotta be fire. The explosive energies. Alright. Let's go. Boom. Here we are. Yeah, it's definitely the explosive energies that does it. Fantastic. All right, which is unfortunate because I'd really love to just use like Arana's uh, secret ancient teaching. Oh, jeez, look at that. Could that hurt me if I was like under that and that physics like all the way down right into my damn skull? Would that just like mortally wound me and kill me, slay me on the spot? Damn, I feel like the answer is yes. Man, fuck those things. Fuck this whole place. Man, Oblivion sucks. Good thing we're never coming back here again. That's not true. That is so not true. <laughs> we gotta do, like, how many of them? Is it 50? Is it 75 of these fucking things? At a certain point, we're just gonna, like, run the fuck through. Oh, God. I forgot that these guys had, like, major fucking reflex. Which is really what's doing us in big time. Oh, shazbot. Oh, there we go. Are they hurting us when Gordon does damage to them? No. All right. There we are. Finish him off, Gordon. Woo! Uh-oh, Gordon is, is toast as hell. All right, that's fine, that's fine. Whew, that is some risky shit. <laughs> what a risky fucking maneuver. All right. Let's see. 
Can we just sort of paralyze it up in there? Oh no. Uh oh, we're gonna fucking die, aren't we? <laughs> I'm not liking this. Oh, I'm not liking this at all. Here, can it reach me from here? Oh shit. I don't know. Here, should we just wait here for a bit and get a, another Gordon? Perhaps. Because I can't, I can't fucking attack it, or else it's just gonna fucking kill me. <laughs> Shit. What a, f what a fucking bastard. Fuck you down there, you little clan fear bastard. Eat a butt. You fucking velociraptor, I'm gonna call, like, Bryce Dallas Howard and Chris Pratt on your ass. Shit. Alright. <laughs> fucking none of, none of the classic people. None, none of, like, like Jeff Goldblum. Nah, not here. Newman? Nah. <laughs> Alright. There we go. But Gordon, on the other hand, is ready to fuck. Get him, Gordon! Uh-oh. Gordon's pathing is not great either. Whee! Gordon! Whenever you want to fight, Gordon! Oh, this was a mistake. This was a mistake. Oh, Gordon is just up there fucking around. Oh, God. Oh, this was bad. We should have summoned Gordon down there. Get it, Gordon! Oh, man. <laughs> Jeez, this, just this one has given us so much trouble. All right, it's fine. Slow and steady wins the race. Jesus Christ. Hope whoever is up inside that horrific tower is just looking down here and really enjoying the damn show. All right. Let's see. Let's come on down here. Let's prime ourselves for uh, one of these suckers and one of these. Fantastic. All right. Do a quick save. Whoop! Oh, that was close. Oh, God. Whoops. I instinctively attacked it, and that was a bad, terrible idea. No! Oh! oh, that was so close. Oh, Gordon. Come on. Pull the aggro. There you go. Yoink. Oh, there you go. Just a little... Just one more, Gordon. One more hit. Please, Gordon, hit it. Oh, fuck! Oh, God! Oh, God! Oh, no. Oh no, this is bad. Oh, this is real bad. Oh, there you go. Whoop. All right. Oh, jeez. Oh, good lord. This really sucks. It was like too down low for Gordon to be able to hit it. <laughs> for fuck's sake. Here, can I actually just kill this thing with fire? Does it have spell reflect? No, it doesn't. All right, great. I can actually just shoot the shit out of it. You think it's fire resistant or like electro resistant? I don't know, but we're gonna find out. Ah, there we go. Didn't have very much health left at all. <sighs> all right. Great. <laughs> Let's repair our stuff. There we go. Oh, my pants were very damaged. Oh, look at dude, its butt shaking. Oh, my God. Look at this thing. Man, dude is twerking big time. All right. Yeah, Oblivion is just horny as hell. It's got to be said. All right. Anything on this? Nope. All right. Can we go up inside of this one? I know some of these, like, si oh, shit. Is that, like, a respawn or something? What is that? Should we not even bother trying to kill all these things? Or are they just gonna respawn faster than I can kill them? Maybe. Maybe that's exactly how this goes. Because I don't remember her being over there. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Does she detect me? Oh, maybe she can smell my fear. Uh-oh. Here, let's sneak on down here. See if we can't maneuver up into this big boy. Let's see. <laughs> Man, that's that also sounded pretty damn s fucking kinky. Let's see if we can't maneuver into this big boy. I'll go into your oblivion gate. And get your sigil stone. Go into the blood well. Mm, that that also sounds bad. <laughs> oh shit. Is there anybody else down here who's fucked up? No? Just an evil Gordon? All right. Oh, look, they're at peace. All right. Peace no more! Unguard, you foul bastard! If I knock him into the spikes, is he gonna just take continual damage? Maybe. I don't know. Oh, yes. The answer is yes. Or maybe that was Gordon smacking him. Could have been. Look, he's stuck in his stupid dancing animation. Good shit. Ugh. And I forgot about these death traps. Jesus. What is this, like, Dungeon Keeper? Jeez. Alright. Let's see. Fix that up. Man, that was such a disappointment when they came out with that new Dungeon Keeper. 
and it turned out to be like a mobile game and not even like a good fun mobile game but like a, one of the really bad ones one of the just like really really rough and bad ones let's quick save here in case I just like fly up there and die instantly look at this fucking thing too corpse masher great it's gonna try and mash me no all right does this activate when I walk onto it no all right gotta remember how all this stuff still works all right what is up there is there gonna be some sort of foul bastard could be yo check this out there's a naked man here all right man is there just a naked look there's a bunch of naked people here just hanging down man oblivion is fucked up oh shit oh great one of these guys all right that's fine oh shit gordon may not fit here gordon might be too damn big all right it's fine gordon is fine here gordon i'll help you out i'll sling some fire actually it's probably better if i use the magic on paralyze <laughs> sorry gordon the tactics ain't great right now there we go good stuff grab its stupid claws all right let's see should we do like some mid jump loots hell yes we should look at that oh oh god <laughs> all right let's try it again huh nope nothing what a waste let's heal up all right let's see do, do we uh yeah we repaired up good stuff all right anything else up here what are these things these things are just disgusting right these are just like gross things Jeez, some bones all right anything oh yeah look at these things. yeah these are for healing right if i remember correctly there's also like ones that are like spa saunas that like give you uh magica i want to say geared batten well batten down the hatches motherfucker we just activated that shit Ugh. What an absolute cacophony. Ugh, jeez. Look at that. I like that. Some good, uh, nice little sound effect. Oh, yeah. Also, in between videos, I almost forgot. That reminded me. I tried to go and, uh, get ourselves fixed up at the, at the old shrine. The, at, uh, like the one in Skingrad or wherever the nearest town was that I went to go do vendoring and stuff at. And, uh, oh shit, is it going down? Oh, yes, it is. All right. See, I thought I remembered them doing that. Them being, like, pressure activated. Oh, is there anything beneath them? No, okay. Maybe sometimes there is, though. Maybe sometimes. But anyway, I went back to uh, Skin Crat or whatever and uh, tried to use its shit. Didn't work out. As it turns out, I'm a bad guy. <laughs> and I can't do that because my infamy is too damn high. I'm just a bad fucking man. And they wouldn't let me. They said, go back home, you bad man. And I just... Instead of going home, I went to hell. <laughs> I, I sent me right to hell, honestly, is what happened. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I forgot. All right. Yep, my bad. Gordon, careful. Careful, Gordon. She's disgruntled. Oh, God. She's shooting shit out of her butt. Oh, she's doing all sorts of spins. The tracking is real bad. Oh, God. Gordon, keep tanking. I'll keep doing... Some damage. Oh, great. Uh, all right. We have another Gordon at the ready. There we go. Fantastic. Man, she is fast as hell. Oh, jeez. Also, she has, like, the strength of, like, the ultimate wizard god. Whoa. Oh, God, Gordon. I think you saved my life. I think I saw it flashing right be before my very eyes. Oh, Gordon, good shit. We make such a dynamic duo, don't we? <laughs> all right. Let's see, let's repair up. There we go. Good stuff. Anything up here? No, there's the gate where we came in from. A nice sort of marker, though. How you can see it from so far. The, uh... The lighting from it. Man, if only you could get, um... Like, your jumping ability high enough to where you could actually just jump right up there. You might be able to jump up on each little, uh... Like, uh, shelf there. Like, each level has like a bit of a shelf that you could maybe work around but I don't know it might be faster to just fortify the shit out of your um, speed rather than try and jump up there 
and just run through everything. You know, just cast invisibility and just run through everything. I feel like that might actually be way faster. Oh shit, Satan himself has come to claim my soul. All right, but not today, Satan. Not today, Lord Dagon. Eat a major butt. All right, get him, Gordon. It's Gordon versus Satan. Hell yeah. Here we go. Look, is Satan uh, immune to my charms? No, he is not. Listen to Satan scream. <laughs> wow, he had a lot of arrows. Oh, field arrows. Okay. Well, that's not really worth taking, is it? Look at fucking Satan. Damn. Dude looks gnarly as shit. All right. Let's see, do we need to head on up in there, or do we have to go to the other tower as well? Who the hell knows? Honestly, since this is our first time in an Oblivion Gate, maybe we should go to all these auxiliary towers. Or at least three of them. Look, it looks like there's four of them. Jesus, how many towers are there? Alright, there we go. Stun his ass right up. Start slinging fire. Look, Gordon, I'll even help out with my... My swordsmanship. Man, they are so damn loud. They are way louder than any other sound effect. Man, I almost killed myself again. Gordon, hang on. Don't pull. Don't pull anything, Gordon. What are you doing? Stop smelling flowers. Oh, Gordon is sniffing farts and pulling aggro in a major way. Oh, God. Okay, there we go. We're, we're free. It's okay. <laughs> Everything's fine. Oh, quick save. Oh, great. Yeah, I think things are just like respawning real fast or something. Shit, I don't know. All right, here we go. Oh, it's a, it's a fight to the death. Gordon v. Gordon. Here, this one we can actually join in and actually play in some minor DPS. Oh, there we go. Yep, gotcha. Oh. There we go. Ironically, the uh, evil Gordons are, like, maybe the easiest enemy to fight. Although our own Gordon is, like, vicious as hell. And just, like, the ultimate killing machine. Here, let's repair up. Oh, look at that! An armorer level! Look at this. Man, we're getting quite a few levels up in here. Only one uh, super requisite level, though. It's gotta be said. Alright. Let's see. Can we go up inside of this one? Or is this not one that has entry? Oh shit, this may not be one that we can even enter. Alright, here, let's consult our local map. There should be- oh, god. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> what? How do you make sense of this? Where am I? What? <laughs> what the fuck? Damn you, Lord Dagon! Damn you to oblivion! You foul bastard! <laughs> Shit. Oh, look, and his little traps are here as well. Oh, you sick fuck. Look, they're even shooting back at me. As if the explosive doomsday scraps weren't bad enough. They have to shoot fire back at me. Jeez, man. Those things really go flying. <laughs> you almost think that they might crash the game or something. You get too many of them just flying around or something? Jeez. Alright. Yeah, it looks like this one we just can't go into. Unless I'm totally missing the, uh, entryway here. Oh, uh, yeah, it must be one that you can- Oh, God. Alright. There we go. Oh, gentle movements is the easiest way to dodge her attack. Oh, shit. Gentle movements, Gordon! Gentle movements! Oh, shit. Oh! There we go. Alright, fine. Please don't shoot me from your butt. At least our magicka comes back real fast now. Oh god, she's doing her hellish scream. Her hell yell. Oh god. Oh god. I don't even know what that shit does, but it turns me purple and I am not a fan of that. Oh god, why was that one so loud? Oh my god. Ugh. Ooh, I'm not liking this. Here, Gordon, I'm quick saving in a very precarious locale. Look, she's healing up. She's doing her sexy maneuver. There we go. 
Grab the silk, grab the venom, grab some healing. <sighs> Man, Oblivion has been one hell of a ride. It's gotta be said. We still haven't even found any fantastic treasures so far. All we found is a man who was killed on the spot. Alright. Look. Over here might be an opportunity for some fantastic treasure. You know what? Here, let's roll up onto her real quick. Get Gordon out. Hope to God that Gordon just, like, slays the crap or just gets paralyzed like nobody's damn business. And gets slapped by Mini-Me. Jeez. Oh, God. Oh, man. Jeez. Gordon, come on. Oh, man, you know what? Jeez, I've been saying Mini-Me here in, like, a mocking manner, but, uh, totally forgot that that guy, Vern Troyer himself, actually... That dude fucking died recently. Man, what a fucking terrible tragedy. Jeez, that is sad as hell. Honestly. I do it in memory of him, not in mockery of him. More so in mockery of, uh... Well, not really anything, I guess. More of a descriptor, huh? Let's see. Oh, shit, yo! Wow! Alright. That's... Eh, that's pretty useless, but, uh... It's worth a pretty penny, huh? Alright, look at this. Yo, she can't reach us. <laughs> this is pretty dope. Alright, look at this. Eat a butt. Gordon, fuck her up. Yeah, Gordon. Get her. <laughs> look, she... Ow! Alright, she can kind of fuck us up. But look, she's really eating the cloud fart. Look at that shit. Uh-oh. Here, Gordon. There we go. Look at this. Look, we can just hide behind this fucking thing. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh! Oh! I was stuck. Oh, I got a little stuck. Oh, jeez. There we go. Oh, Gordon. You did good, but I'm stuck. Oh, it's not looking good for me. Alright. There we go. I'm free. Free at last. Ugh. Can I... Oh, jeez. I can't... I can't even rest anywhere. Oh, here we go. Great. Let's see, is this one that we have not been into, that we can even access? I'm thinking that the ones with these, um, sort of, uh, up high bridges are ones that we can't access from down below, right? Yeah, I think so. Does this one have a, a super high bridge? Oh, shit, look at this! A sump of misery. Huh. Alright, well, let's, uh, pump this sump. Oh, shit. Oh, jeez, this is some close quarters area. I don't like how resistant these, uh, these ladies are to paralysis, honestly. That's like my secret trick. Oh, fuck. <clears throat> yeah, they don't- oh, shit. Oh, it was that thing. Should we just hang back here? And just kinda let this sort itself out? Hmm, maybe. Maybe. Gordon, I'm- I'm counting on you to be doing some work over there, pal. Uh-oh. Okay, let's head on out here. Let's see. Are the little babies gonna come out? Oh, yes. Well, no, no. It's, it's just Big Mama. Oh, shit. She's, like, spawning on top of my ass. All right. I mean, that ain't great. Oh, jeez. Okay. Oh, shit. Do we have three of them on us? Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, Oblivion sucks. Oh, man. What are they doing? Oh, Jesus. Why are there so many of them here? Oh god! They're really trying to electro... Electro jam all over my ass. For fuck's sake! There's another one over here! Oh god, they keep respawning. Oh jeez! Uh, uh, I'm not liking it! Uh oh. Can she see me? Does she have a line of sight? Oh shit, is that one like really huge? No, I think she's just standing on top of a rock. Okay. Oh! Oh god! Alright. I'm going into stealth mode here. Quick saving. All right, Gordon, how's it going? You fighting the good fight? Yeah, Gordon's doing it. No, oh God. How many have we aggroed? Jesus, there's two dead down there, two up here. Did we have four of them on us? Oh God. Gordon, get down there. Fight. <laughs> Shit me. Oh my God. Look at this. This is hell! This is a fresh hell. Alright. At the very least, we should we should wait. I'm very reticent to uh, be using up our consumables before we have even entered the main tower. I feel like we need to give it a rest a bit here. Once we enter the tower, we'll probably start making heavy use of, like, uh, 
Magicka potions, all that good shit. Oh shit, where is she? There she is. Oh god, please don't get me! Oh, she got me! Alright, that's fine. That's fine. Look. We quick saved. So shortly after. It's all fine. Oh, Jesus, look at this. This is a real dicey situation. Oh, God! Oh, man, I was in stealth mode. Look, I need to get out of stealth mode. This is a, a bad move to be in stealth mode like that. A rookie mistake. Gordon, slap him. Give him a smack, give him a... Make him a snack. There we go, Gordon. Good shit. Oh, look at that. Did you get her? Yeah, good shit, Gordon. Damn. <clears throat> oh, fuck! Jesus! All right. <laughs> All right, Gordon, I'm going to use you as like a body blocker. There we go. Gordon, keep body blocking for me. Oh, shit, she's trying to block your attacks. There we go. Oh, man. Good stuff. I think the, the fart plants really helped out there. <sighs> Jeez. Jeez Louise. Man, these titty ladies are powerful as hell. All right. Let's see. Oh, God, is that thing about to slap the shit out of me? The answer is always. All right, let's see. Let's claim all of our prizes. I, I haven't even taken a glance at what these things actually do. These, uh, materials? Oh, no, wait, this one's been dead for a while. Okay. So was it only three that we actually had on us? Maybe so, maybe so. Burden, Night Eye, Paralyze, Restore Fatigue. That ain't great. Honestly, that ain't great. Alright. Let's go on up in here. Maybe the other two, uh... Sort of things that it does, um... Components. Ah! Oh, God! What was it? What even got me? Was it this one? Ah! No! It's not even moving, dude! Is there, like, some secret thing underneath the ground? Fuck that, I'm not going over there. I ain't going over there at all! Alright. Jeez. Jeez, jeez, jeez. Uh, uh, jeez! Alright. Oh, shit! Oh, my good god! Holy crap! Battle Axe of the Blaze! Yes, please. 47 uses? I'll take it. An Elven Helmet? Sure, why not? Minor Innovation? 58 gold? Oh, it was worth coming in here. Oh, they're ancient secret sacks of joy. Uh, well, this one didn't have much joy in it. But this one, that fleshy pod... Oh, that was a real winner. How about this one? Nope. That, that one's a loser. Alright, fine. The desolate well? Or should we just jump down this hidey hole? Wait. Was there a hidey hole? No, there may have not been. No, there is no hidey hole here. Alright. Look, we're too fast for these things as well. Here, can we hurt ourselves by walking into these? Ugh. Okay, no, we're fine. Ugh. Jeez, I just had to test it out. You know, for future reference. Alright, let's head in deeper. Oh, sh shit! Alright, Gordon! It's time to rumble, Gordon! Oh, Gordon, it's time to rumble. Oh, jeez. Oh, my God! Her electroshock sound effect is very powerful. It sounds so powerful. Jeez, and these things keep trying to slap my ass. Good God. Gordon, I hope you're doing okay in there. It doesn't sound like you are. Did you at least kill- Oh, no, you didn't. No, you didn't. All right, there you go, Gordon. Mess him up, mess him up. Oh, God, they're messing me up. Jeez, they are just paralyzing the crap out of Gordon and slapping me all over the place. Jeez, I'm Pete. Oh, God. Okay, Gordon, get get on her. Mess her up. Where are you going, Gordon? Oh, Gordon, she, she was right there. Oh, turn around, Gordon. Oh, Gordon. Oh, what are you doing? What are you doing, Gordon? Oh, God, look, I'm going to have to come in. Oh, shit, no, I'm not. Oh, God, the plants. The plants. All right. Oh, jeez. We can't paralyze them. Oh, man, they are powerful as hell. They're powerful as damn hell. Is Gordon in there fighting them, maybe? Oh, I hope so. I hope Gordon is just killing them up big time. Let's do a quick save and take a peek inside. Oh, Gordon ain't doing jack shit. Alright, there you go, Gordon. Yeah, Slayer! Look, getting the double hits! Oh! Oh, God! Gordon! Oh, no! Oh, be gone! Be gone! Are they coming out? 
Oh god, I thought that was one of them. There they are. Oh shit. Jeez! He even shot me around Gordon. What a bastard. There you go, Gordon. She's almost dead, I think. There we go. Did you get her? There's still one more in there, Gordon. She might come out. Let's quickly seize this opportunity to heal up. <sighs> Man, this is some stressful shit. <laughs> oh, where'd she go? Was she just, like, an illusion? Oh, that's weird. That's unsettling. Where'd the other one go? I don't like that at all. Did she pat back? Oh, she did! Alright. Gordon, here we go again. Another round. Oh god, here. I'll try and tank the little one. Okay, it's not working out, Gordon. You know what? Hey, Gordon. See you, dude. Good luck. Oh shit, she's coming with me, Gordon! Oh look, oh, oh my god, you've killed her somehow. Somehow, Gordon, you've done it. Oh, <laughs> you brilliant bastard. What happens if we wait while this thing is moving? Alright, okay, great. Good thing the physics engine does not obey the laws of time. Excellent. Man, stuff in the realm of oblivion. It's canon. That's just how things work here. <laughs> things are bizarre. Strange in this foreign plane. <laughs> Alright, let's search these naked men. Two gold! Alright. And nothing. And three gold. Yeah. Alright, good stuff. Granted, uh, you know what? We found some really valuable items earlier. So maybe it's not as good as you would think. Right? Maybe we should be using the enchantments on these things to fight these titty ladies. How many are up here? Just one? Looks like it. Ooh, and some nice still-beating hearts. Mmm, Edgar Allan Poe would be proud. Alright. Let's see, what do we have here that we can just sling at them? Oh, I thought we had another weapon. Maybe not. Alright. Whip out the battle axe, do a quick save. Come in here. For some sweet slashes. Oh, fuck, she's slashing me up. Let's get some healing going on. Look, is it affecting Gordon as well? Jeez! Oh my god! Alright, didn't work out as well as I would have thought. Good gravy, man! Her electroshock sometimes is just super powered. Maybe she's resistant to flames. I'm not sure. Nah, it seems relatively effective. Oh, fuck. Save me, Gordon! Ah. It's up to you! Oh, jeez! Ah. Oh, god! Just as I had activated the healing fountain. Alright. Maybe... Because the healing fountain isn't instant. It's relatively slow. Maybe we need to activate this thing ahead of time. There we go. Yeah, grab some healing in advance. That's the good shit. There we go. We'll just slice away at her damn butt. Man, she is just eating up the charges on this thing. She must be resistant or something to fire. Gotta be. Alright, get another Gordon out. Here we go. Let's quick save here now that we're in a safe spot. Flank around. Oh god, the little baby. Oh god, mama's jumping. Mama's pissed. Oh, oh, there we go. Oh, good shit, Gordon. Good shit. Man, by the way, this battle axe looks cool as hell. Whoa. And also, this guy is really not cool as hell. He's on fire. <laughs> That's what he is. All right. Man, there's a lot of dudes way up there. Jesus. Look at that. They are so high up there. Alright. Grab some of these. What's in here? Void salts. Oh, shit. A grand soul gem. Empty as well. Huh. Could use that for another uh, enchantment or something. Alright. 330 gold? Alright, yeah. I think it was worth it to come through here. Okay. Well, when next we come back, I think the only place we have left to... Uh, you know what, I'd bring up the map, but what's the point, right? <laughs> what is the fucking point? Uh, I think when next we come back, we will head up into the main tower and finally clear out the, the uh, rest of all this. But for now, we will do just a bit of reading. And that is reading the first of four volumes of Brief History of the Empire. There we go. Yeah, these are relatively quick. Let's see. 12, 11... 
10, 12. Yeah, these are way quicker than uh, the Baron Zaya uh, anthology, right? All right. A Brief History of the Empire, Part 1, by Stronach Carthage III, Imperial Historian. Before the rule of Tiber Septim, all Tamriel was in chaos. The poet Tresitzes uh, called that period of continuous unrest days and nights of blood and venom. The kings were a petty lot of grasping tyrants who fought Tiber's attempts to bring order to the land. But they were as disorganized as they were dissolute, and the strong hand of Septim brought peace forcibly to Tamriel. The year was Second Era 896. The following year, the Emperor declared the beginning of a new era. Thus began the Third Era, Year Aught. For thirty-eight years, the Emperor Tiber reigned supreme. It was a lawful, pious, and glorious age, when justice was known to one and all, from serf to sovereign, uh, from serf to sovereign. On Tiber's death, it reigned for an entire fortnight, as if the land of Tamriel itself was weeping. The emperor's grandson, Pelagius, came to the throne. Though his reign was short, he was as strong and resolute as his father had been, and Tamriel could have enjoyed a continuation of the Golden Age. Alas, an unknown enemy of the Septim family hired that accursed organization of cutthroats, the Dark Brotherhood, to kill the Emperor Pelagius I as he knelt at prayer at the Temple of the One in the Imperial City. Pelagius I's reign lasted less than three years. Good lord. Pelagius had no living children, so the crown imperial passed to his first cousin, the daughter of Tiber's brother, Agnareth, Kintiara, uh, Kintiara, former queen of Sylvanar, assumed the throne as Kintiara I. I think we heard about Kintiara in the, um, the Wolf Queen books, right? She wasn't the Wolf Queen herself, of course, but, uh, we, we heard about her in there. Or maybe one of her, dis one of the other Kintiaras. Anyway, her reign was blessed with prosperity and good harvests, and she herself was an avid patroness of art, music, and dance. Kinchara's son was crowned after her death, the first emperor of Tamriel to use the imperial name Uriel. Uriel I was the great lawmaker of the Septim dynasty, and a promoter of independent organizations and guilds. Under his kind but firm hand, the Fighter's Guild and the Mage's Guild increased in prominence throughout Tamriel. His son and successor, Uriel II, reigned for 18 years, from the death of Uriel I in the Third Era 64 to Pelagius II's ascension in Third Era 82. Tragically, the rule of Uriel II was cursed with blights, plagues, and insurrections. The tenderness he inherited from his father did not serve Tamriel well, and little justice was done. Pelagius II inherited not only the throne from his father, but the debt from the latter's poor financial and judicial management. Pelagius dismissed all of the Elder Council, and allowed only those willing to pay great sums to resume their seats. He encouraged similar acts among his vassals, the kings of Tamriel, and by the end of his 17th year reign, 17 year reign, Tamriel had returned to prosperity. His critics, however, have suggested that any advisor possessed of wisdom, but not of gold, had been summarily ousted by Pelagius. This may have led to some of the troubles his son Antiochus faced when he in turn became emperor. Antiochus was certainly one of the more flamboyant members of the usually austere Septim family. He had numerous mistresses and nearly as many wives, and was renowned for the grandeur of his dress and his good and his high good humor unfortunately his reign was rife with civil war surpassing that surpassing even that of his grandfather uriel the second 
the War of the Isle in the Third Era, 110, 12 years after Antiochus assumed the throne, nearly took the province of Somerset Isle away from Tamriel. The united alliance of the kings of Somerset and Antiochus only managed to defeat King Orghum of the island kingdom of Pydonia due to a freak storm. Legend credits the Sigic Order of the Isle of Arteum with the sorcery behind the Tempest. The, so the story of Kintiara II, heiress to her father Antiochus' throne, is certainly one of the saddest tales in imperial history. Her first cousin, Uriel, son of Queen Potema, yeah, there we go, Potema uh, of Solitude, accursed, accused Kintiara of being a bastard alluding to the infamous decadence of the imperial city during her father's reign. Right, yeah, we've read about that exactly, that ac those accusations. When this accusation failed to stop her coronation, Uriel bought the support of several disgruntled kings of High Rock, Skyrim, and Morrowind, and with Queen Potema's assistance, he coordinated three attacks on the Septim Empire. The first attack occurred in the Iliac Bay region, which separates High Rock and Hammerfell. Kintiara's entourage was massacred, and the Empress taken captive. For two years, Kintiara II languished in an imperial prison believed to be somewhere in Glenpoint or Glenmoril before she was slain in her cell under mysterious circumstances. The second attack was on a series of imperial garrisons along the coastal Morrowind Islands, the Empress's consort, Contin Arinx, fell defending the forts. The third and final attack was a siege of the Imperial City itself, occurring after the Elder Council had split up the army to attack Western High Rock and Eastern Morrowind. The weakened government had little defense against Uriel's determined aggression, and capitulated after only a fortnight of resistance. Uriel took the throne that same evening, and proclaimed himself Uriel III, Emperor of Tamriel. The year was Third Era 121. Thus began the War of the Red Diamond, described in Volume 2 of this series. Huh! Yeah, wow, it really is pretty brief compared to, like, uh, the last two, uh, big anthologies that we read. It's true to its name. It's brief. Hmm. Yeah. Interesting stuff. Bunch of names. I do like reading through this, though, having read uh, some of these other books, because a lot of the names are, are now more and more familiar, right? Always fun when that happens. Anyway, like I said, when next we come back, we'll continue up into the big asshole. The, the big asshole. Yep, that's where we're going. We're going on up in there. Gotta heal up here, too. Look at that. Some of that good-ass healing. Fixing stuff up. Anyway, till next time. Peace! Peace!